Welcome everyone. So today we are going to understand what is the value of 9 raised to 5 plus 9 raised to 4 plus 9 raised to 3 plus 9 raised to 2 plus 9. Okay. So please understand when you have something like this, what we will try to do is we will try to take pairs. Okay. And we will keep the last 9 as it is. Now in this case, see these kind of questions only help you or you need to understand the trick while solving these kind of questions because they are normally asked when you don't have to use the calculator. Okay. So now between 9 raised to 5 and 9 raised to 4, what is common? I can say 9 raised to 4 is common. And I'm left with what? 9 plus 1. Similarly, 9 raised to 3 and 9 raised to 2, what is common? 9 raised to 2 is common. And I'm left with 9 plus 1. Plus there is 9. Now let's do one thing. Again, we'll try to pair these two. So what will happen is what bracket can come out? We have 9 plus 1 outside the bracket. Also, I can have 9 square outside the bracket. And this will be now left what in this place. We are just left with 9 raised to 2 plus 1 plus 9. Let's solve this. So 9 plus 1 gets you 10 into 9 square which is 81 into 9, 8, 9 square plus 1 gets you 82 plus 9. Now students, please understand, you can do this this way, 810 into 82, yes, you can do it. But I would show you a method in which you can actually do this using a rainbow method. Now rainbow method, what is rainbow method? Okay, so your see, understand, we are doing, I am going to explain you with 81 into 82. Okay, but first I am going to explain you with a smaller example, 21 into 22 if you had or let's say not 22 if you had 24 okay if that was the case then in that case what you would have done is see you would have taken the help of rainbow method now what is your rainbow method you just multiply the last digit of both the numbers so 1 into 4 gets you 4 then you multiply the first digit of both the numbers which is 4 into 4 gets you 4 next what you do is you multiply the first and the second digit so first, sorry, last digit of the first number and the first digit of the second number that gets you 1 into 2 gets you 2. Similarly, 4 into 2 gets you 8. So now all you have to do is add 8 plus 2 gets you 10. So you just keep the last digit of 10 that is 0 and take the 1 carry. So final answer is 504. So easily you could do this with the rainbow method. I know while explaining it takes a bit of time. I, if you want, I will make a special dedicated video of rainbow method. In that, I will take a lot of difficult examples as well. Okay, but now coming to your particular question, we can say what will be, okay, no, I don't need to put the dash. What we will do first is multiply the first and the last digit, that is 2. Then first and the first digit, that gets you 64. Next is what we will do is we will multiply 1 into 8, that gets you 8. And 8 into 2, that gets you 16. Add both of them. So, you get 24. Out of this, the last digit, we'll write 4 as it is. And add 2 to the next number. So, final answer then comes out to be 6, 6, 4, 2. Okay. So, here I can say 10 into 81 into 82 gets you 6, 6, 4, 2 plus 9. So, now 10 into 6, 6, 4, 2 is getting you what? 6, 6, 4. 4, 2, 0 plus 9. So final answer is 6, 6, 4, 2, 9. Okay, so you saw how easy you could do this without the help of calculator. Say, if you want me to do more of rainbow methods or you want me to show you more examples of multiplication with different tricks, please type a yes in the comment section. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.